the pioneering audio performance of the all-new Nissan Micra Hatchback has won its first big award. The Bose personal system, with innovative speakers built into the driver's headrest, has been honored by the readers of Auto Build. The respected German automotive title joined forces with Computer Build magazine to stage their annual Connected Car Awards to highlight the best new technology from the world of in-car infotainment. Bose Personal in the Nissan Micra was voted number one in the entertainment sound category by readers of both titles. Helen Perry, general manager, Small Cars, Nissan Europe, commented, Germany is often said to be the home of automotive innovation and has a highly developed automotive industry. For the Bose Personal Audio System in the Nissan Micra to win this award is a great achievement. Bose Personal sets a new standard in small car audio and is unique to the Nissan Micra. Custom engineered for the hatchback's uplifting interior, its six speakers include two in the driver's headrest. The broad range of speaker performance means the system does not require a subwoofer to create bass sounds, a component which often compromises boot space. The speakers work in tandem with the Bose Personal Space Virtual Audio Technology. It's a pioneering digital signal processing system which creates a vivid and rich 360 degrees listening experience even at higher volumes. Drivers can choose their desired level of audio immersion though the Micra's Nissan Connect infotainment system. Helen added, this honor from AutoBuild and Computer Build readers is a tribute to the dedicated hard work from the audio teams at Bose and Nissan, who have created such an amazing listening experience for Micra customers. Bo's personal audio is standard on the range topping Tecma grade, and available as an option on Enconnecta and Ascenda. So far, approximately 37% of Micra customers have bought a Nissan Micra with Bose personal fitted. Falcon Tire Corporation CX CEO 01 All Season Tires have earned the original equipment fitment on Subaru's largest vehicle ever, the 2019 Subaru Ascend. The vehicle was unveiled at the Los Angeles Auto Show. The Subaru Ascent is fitted with CX CEO 01 tires in size 245 60 R18, and size 245 50 R20 for the limited trim level vehicle. David Coletti Falcon's Vice President of Original Equipment says, We are very proud to have Falcon tires selected for Subaru's new handle SUV. It's obvious the Ascent is a very important vehicle to Subaru and critical to its lineup as it becomes Subaru's biggest SUV. We know our Falcon ZX line of tires is a perfect match to this vehicle. Falcon says the ZX CEO 01 AS incorporates the latest in technology and design. The tire has four circumferential grooves to evacuate water and enhance hydroplane resistance and stability in wet conditions. Chamfer tread block corners support even wear throughout the tire's life, and a solid center rip targets excellent handling response. The all-new Ascent will be built at Subaru's U.S. plant, Subaru of Indiana Automotive Inc., and delivered to Subaru retailers in early summer 2018. For more information, visit www.falcontire.com. Just a few weeks after opening the Model 3 configurator to regular reservation holders on the East Coast and Midwest, Tesla now started deliveries to customers without employee priority. For the first few months of Model 3 production, Tesla limited deliveries to employees, family members of employees, and other company insiders, like early investors and board members. It started opening the online configurator to regular Model 3 reservation holders in California in November and started deliveries in December. During the first week of 2018, Tesla expanded invites to several more states like New York, New Jersey, Maryland, Massachusetts, and Illinois. Electrex Seth Weintraub got an invite recently and was given a time frame of four weeks for deliveries, but it looks like some are getting their Model 3 vehicles on a quicker time frame. We are getting reports this week of several deliveries on the East Coast and especially in the Northeast. 
Several Model 3 vehicles being prepped for delivery were also spotted at Tesla stores following the first Model 3 display cars hitting showrooms last weekend. Outside of employee priority, it appears that Model 3 deliveries are still limited to first-day reservation holders who are also current Tesla owners. Nissan has endowed its best-selling model, the Rogue Compact Crossover, with a host of new features for 2018. Chief among them are ProPilot Assist Advanced Driver Assistance Technology and Nissan Connect Integrated Audio, Navigation and Communication with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay Entertainment Systems. ProPilot Assist helps drivers stay the course by keeping the car centered in its lane, navigating stop-and-go traffic, keeping a set speed, and maintaining a set distance from the vehicle in front of it. Nissan emphasizes that the system is a hands-on, not self-driving, feature. It cannot be left unattended. Driver vigilance with hands on the wheel is still required and the system isn't capable of driving safely all by itself. ProPilot Assist is a major move toward having self-driving Nissans in the future. Assorted existing safety and convenience features are also added to some rogue models for 2018, and several option packages have been revised. The third row seat option offered on the previous version has gone missing, leaving rogue with a maximum carrying capacity of five people. This is not a deal-breaking loss, since the two-passenger third row didn't have a lot to offer in the way of room or comfort. There are three trim levels of the 2018 rogue all with a choice of front wheel or all-wheel drive, S, SV and SL. Base pricing for the S model starts at $25,775 including a $975 destination charge. Our tester was the SL model with all-wheel drive. It comes standard with an impressive, inclusive list of safety, comfort and convenience equipment. All models have a 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine producing 170 horsepower and 175 pounds FT of torque. It is paired with a continuously variable transmission CVT. Fuel economy ratings are 26-33-29 mpg with front-wheel drive, and 25-32-27 mpg with all-wheel drive. Engine performance is decent but some turbocharging would come in handy. Under ordinary circumstances the engine does well, but there are some issues when the driver demands strong acceleration. It's not so much that Rogue's response is weak, it's that the revving engine emits a tenor tone. A tenor tone is magnificent in an Italian opera singer, but a car engine should be bass or at least baritone. Rogue's exterior design is subtle, not attention-seeking, that's not an undesirable thing for a compact crossover. There's some flamboyance on the inside, enough to qualify it as above average in attractiveness for its class. The interior also provides a goodly amount of room and comfort, and a civilized ride with an acceptable amount of road noise. Rear seat legroom is an inviting 37.9 inches. The rear cargo area provides up to 70 cubic feet with second row seats folded. The flat load floor has two removable panels under which there is hidden stowage space, and a retractable cargo cover is available as a $190 option. Subaru won't be advertising the new 2019 Ascent 3 row vehicle on any Super Bowl spots but they will still score big with families on Super Bowl Sunday. Subaru, a sponsor of the Screen Actors Guild Awards, announced Sunday night they will feature four new TV ads on Super Bowl Sunday on Animal Planet's Puppy Bowl again, and the Cherry Hill, New Jersey automaker will feature the all-new 2019 Ascent family hauler. Subaru will get help from the Barkley Dog family riding in the new Ascent 3 row vehicle as they launch the Super Bowl Sunday ads. Brian Cavallucci, 
National Advertising Manager for Subaru of America, says this is the eighth consecutive year for the automaker being featured at the Puppy Bowl on Animal Planet. A 30-second Super Bowl ad will cost more than $5 million this year according to Sports Illustrated, so it's understandable why Subaru would choose another channel to advertise the new Ascent family vehicle. Subaru knows many of their customers love dogs and they are capitalizing on this again in 2018. Subaru says, 8 out of 10 Subaru owners are pet owners. Even if you don't own a Subaru, the commercials are good. The national television spots are created by ad agency Carmichael Lynch on behalf of Subaru of America. They created the dog-tested, dog-approved campaign that has been a huge success for the brand. The ads should score big with families in two ways, as they pay tribute to the scenarios Subaru drivers find themselves in with their own families while also showcasing the brand's long-standing love of pets. Subaru even used the Barkley Dog family at the launch of the all-new Subaru Ascent family vehicle when it was unveiled at the LA Auto Show. Tom Dahl, CEO of Subaru of America announced the new three-row family hauler as the Barkley family drove in the car onto the stage and then piled out to pose for the media. Cavalucci says, we have a long-term commitment to pets and animal welfare, so the Barkley family has been a natural way for us all to bond over the shared love of pets. Plus, they're fun and a bit of whimsy. We've all imagined what our pets' alter egos would be. The Barkleys is living that out loud. With so many dog lovers in America, Subaru is capitalizing on it. The newest Barkley family dog ads will focus on the all-new 2019 Subaru Ascent that will surely be a big family and dog pleaser. The all-new 2019 Subaru Ascent will be on sale in early summer 2018.